Hello everyone, today we are gonna be doing my September setup and the first thing I wanna do is change out the cover. I'm not gonna go for a super like fall feeling cover because it's still 100 degrees here. So I'm bringing in one of my favorite covers that I haven't used. Taking off this cute, I think this one's called like Woven or something like that. It's an Edivy cover that came out with the new release. Sorry if this is loud. I still need to change the coil I really wanna go gold, but I, I'm scared. So I may do that. I probably will do it off camera because I'm probably gonna fail. <laughs> I am bringing in this cover. I don't know if this is still available. I should do a cover. If you guys are interested, I'll do my cover collection. I have too many and I probably, maybe I can do like a help me get rid of some, but I like the orange color. I feel like it's kind of fallish and this is, Oranges, I'm assuming. So, oh, look, this one's new. I've had this on a bigger, on a bigger um, book before. It was on like a notebook for nursing school, and I obviously haven't used the small one because all of the little like tabs are popping off. That's when you know you have too many covers if you're not even using them. <laughs> I, there's just no way for me to use them all. I could change my cover. I don't know how many I have, but I could change my cover. Some people are so good at putting these on. I'm not good at it. Um, but I honestly could change my covers probably, probably multiple times a week and not repeat them in a year. I've, I'm given a lot of stuff from Erin Condren, and then I used to like feel like I needed to get every cover. Now I hardly ever change my cover. I'm kind of forcing myself to just because I feel guilty about never using them. So I think this is a cute cover. I feel like it's a good like color for September. And um, yeah, okay. So there we have, we're gonna set up the September. In my past months, I've actually used my Erin Condren decor stickers and Erin Condren um, functional stickers. So they match with the, the design that's already in here. For September, I've decided I'm gonna use my e-kits, which is like a full, completely redo the, the page kit, and we're gonna go apples. It's this kit. So I'm gonna put these down, turn it upside down so I can see what I'm doing a little bit better. And my um, Erin Condren functional ones, the only problem with this is the design of this at a V goes into the coil all right, so you can just barely see it. It probably is not going to bother anyone, but just be aware, it does go in there. In some ways, I, I do like the look of my Erin Condren decor kits better, and you can make it so it's Monday start with those. This is fun too. Okay, I'm gonna use these little wood grain stickers across the bottom. Okay, and the last thing, you can put the, the numbers down, you can choose not to. I sometimes do and sometimes don't. Today, I am going to because I like the look of the red with, I don't know, I just feel like it's cute because we're gonna do apple kits along this. So it is a little tedious for me. <laughs> That's the only reason that I sometimes choose not to do it is some, I know some people love doing this. I think it's cute without it too. If you decide that you that it is too much for you, you can totally, totally skip this step. I don't know if you guys can hear, but we have right up by our window, right in front of me, I'm sitting in front of a window, there's a bush <laughs> and it's a little windy today. It's like scratching my window um, and it does it all day. And I, I kind of love the sound, but if you can hear it in the video, that's what that is. My husband asked me if, if I wanted him to trim it and I, I told him no, because I kind of just love it. I don't know why that sound is kind of like peaceful to me. If I could live somewhere, it would be somewhere where I could have the windows open and a breeze going in my house all year long. We always sleep with the windows open, except in the month, the summer months. And I just love that. I love hearing, you know, birds in the morning. And I love hearing, feeling the wind and just the fresh air. It's one of my favorite things. And Vegas, just, I'm sick of summer. I'm sick of it. And I know it's not helping me <laughs> complaining about it, but sometimes you just have to let yourself 
feel bad about it. Okay, I have these and I they have some of the holidays. I only could, I obviously can't fit in every holiday. So I try just to pick the ones that I feel like you know, most people use or celebrate or get off at work or school. So we have Labor Day, Patriot Day, and the first day of autumn are the ones that I chose for this month. I wish I could do every religious holiday and every celebration, but yeah, I just, I can't, I can't fit them in. Um, so those are the ones that I chose for this month. It's basically the ones that are usually written in your planner that I also use. I use the Erin Condren or Moxie Life Planners to actually see what they've chosen, and I copy those generally. So that's what we're getting here. It's just the ones that they written here. I'm gonna put this down on the Autumn Begins Day, just because I think it's cute. And then I can put the Autumn Begins on top of it. And the number sticker because there is nothing that I want to celebrate more than the first day of autumn and then maybe I'll put this one down here I have all of these that you can use to put things down I'm probably only going to mark birthdays and paydays on here I'm actually gonna put this here over this and take my birthday sticker and instead of putting birthdays in there I'm gonna do this little note section as a birthday section. And then I'm gonna mark just a couple of things in here. So every Tuesday, my daughter has dance. And every Wednesday, my daughter has drama. And every Thursday, we have piano. So I'm gonna put that down as well. And then instead of writing it on all those days, I usually take this little ruler of mine, that's my favorite, and I line it up to the third eighth of an inch mark. The coil gets in the way for this side, so I'm just gonna turn it around. I draw a little arrow to let me know that it happens on each day. And then I'm gonna write on those what, what they are. And I'm not gonna bore you with writing in all my stuff, but that's something that I always do is that I, I do any repeating event with that. So I I thought I would show you. So that's it. I'm gonna put the birthdays here and then the rest of my major appointments that have to do with the whole family go in here. If they're just like a mammogram or something like that's just for me, I usually put that in my week. So I won't put it into this one. And then I'm going to set up this. This is the one that I'm a little like hesitant about because the purple coming off of here I think is really going to bother me but maybe I can cover it up so I am going to be using my DB kits and in the past months like like the monthly I've just been using my Erin Condren functional decor stickers that match which would be so cute in here but I, I've just missed these so I wanted to bring them in okay so September I'm gonna put this down here September is one of those months that I feel like I guess purple works, but it's it's one of the Erin Condren things that I just don't quite get. I wish that it was a yellow or something different. I don't know. This apple kit, I obviously did because back to school and I feel like harvesting apples happens in September, October. And this is when I start missing having the canvas, like the blank one. I really have been loving using my functional kits, so I don't mind, but I just wanted to do something different this month. I'm gonna try just to let that top corner not bother me <laughs> and call it good. Okay, so there is it set up and then we will write in in just a second. On this side over here, I usually do track what I have been purchasing. So let me show you. Here's the one from August. I just track the purchases. But this month I want to do a 30 day challenge and I'm gonna do six different habits that I'm gonna track this month. So I'm bringing in this full page sticker. It's a 30 day challenge. You can use this as like one a month and do it for six months, a 30 day challenge, but I'm actually gonna do th uh, six different habits in 30 days. 
So they're nothing major. I just, it's just something that I want to use to kind of kickstart, to finish up. I'm, I'm really close to my goal weight and I just, I just want to finish it. It's really frustrating to me that I've kind of been sitting at the same weight for three months. The last thing I want to do is just add a little bit of decor on here before I start filling it out. I want to put in this like cute, it's like one of those turntable. Do you guys have these in your house? I have one. <laughs> Just like, I don't decorate mine, but I do put fruits and vegetables on it. I wanna bring an apple up here. Maybe this greenery. I wanna tie in the 30 day challenge with some apples or something. So, but there's not a lot of space on there. I don't know what I can fit over there. Maybe nothing. Maybe I'm gonna put this and then I'll cut it off the top. And then I wanna bring some over here as well. So I'm gonna use the little, I think this is so cute, the little car down here. I think I'll do an apple tree right here as well. Oh, that looks weird. <laughs> Doesn't that look weird? I'm gonna move this. Maybe I'll move it here because that's actually the end of the month. Okay, I'm gonna put that down there. And I love this little apple cake. Maybe I'll do that with birthdays. Let's do that. I'm gonna, this birthday is crooked so it's bugging me. I'm actually gonna put the birthday down. I'm gonna put the apple cake there and then put the birthday right underneath it. And maybe something for autumn begins. Maybe I'll do this little candle. I wanna add in some of these things that I wanna track. We are going to be doing, it's kind of like spring cleaning. It's so hot in the summer and it gets really dusty here in Vegas. I always feel like we need to do a major cleaning here at the end of the summer. So we're gonna have a little bit of like a fall cleaning, kind of like spring cleaning. I like to keep track of the sticker kits that I am making for my shop for the upcoming sticker release. So I'm gonna put sticker kits there. And then down here, I want to track the books I'm reading. Then for this one, I was thinking of tracking my orders here since I don't, I'm not leaving myself space for that here. And I don't need goals because this is my goals for the month. But yeah, I think I'm gonna do finances and just track what I'm ordering. It's good for me to kind of see that because I'm not great at, I'm just not great at budgeting. And when I write it down, I it always makes me think, do I really need it? So I like tracking that. And I think I'm just gonna draw a line here for what I order and then the price. Next, I wanna fill in the things I wanna do. So these are health goals for the most part that I want to track. And I'm gonna be using, I think I'm gonna use some clear stickers on here that will be listed in my shop fairly soon. Maybe I'll try to have them up before this, but they're the size of this so you can just put them on when you actually do this, do the stuff or you can just color it in, put a clear, a zig clean color dot on it too. The things I wanna do are I want to get in my water. So I'm shooting for 80 ounces of water every day. And kind of in that same nutrition vein, I am also shooting for 100 ounces, or I'm sorry, not 100 ounces, 100 grams of protein every day. My husband and I decided in the month of September that we are going to not have sugar. And by not having sugar, just like desserts. So we can have fruits and we can have oh in our oatmeal we can put in a little sugar or something but we are not going to eat like a cookie <laughs> if that makes any sense none no treats and we're counting that as a no sugar okay and then on this side i want to do some sort of spiritual study every day and in, kind of to go along with that i also want to get in daily prayer and this last one, just to make it easy on me, because working out is kind of easy for me. It's something that I don't even want to miss. It's something that I love. I'm putting it here just so I can have for sure have something that I mark off. Because I'm just, this is just information for me. I'm going to try to have every day, but I know that I, I probably won't. Working out, on the other hand, other than Sunday, I feel like, I feel like this will be the one that is the best filled in. Although I'm I'm shooting for perfect, but you know. Okay, so those are my, that's my 30 day challenge for the month of September. And I'm excited about, 
about filling that one in. I think that's it for the month of September. I'm Like I said, I'm not going to bore you with filling in every appointment that I have going on. That's not very interesting. But I think that is cute and it'll be fun to fill out throughout the week. There's my first week that we already filmed. Thank you so much for watching this quick little setup of September. I hope you have an amazing month of September and I hope that this gave you some ideas if you are interested in any of these stickers. They are available in my shop. I have a coupon code that is just for YouTube friends in my down bar. So if you are watching, you can enjoy 20% off of these. Kit 126 has a weekly kit that goes with it as well, which I will be using sometime this month. And then of course my full page stickers are always available and great way to fill in those blank notes pages. I hope you all have an amazing day and I will talk to y'all very soon. See you. Bye.